drive for a manufacturer like Porsche is something special to be here in Le Mans. The atmosphere and the pressure growing up day after day. For Porsche, for myself, the only thing is to win. Everybody is waiting again for a Porsche win and uh, we are also waiting for that, so it's perfect. It's a tricky track for a lot of reasons and, and I think it's, it's still one of the tracks that, that makes you feel alive. For me, it's definitely time for another win. So we're going to push and uh, try to win it. We're all experienced enough to know what it takes to win a 24-hour race, so uh, that's what we're, all, what we're up for and what we're going for. A good result would mean that we have no issues in 24 hours for both cars. Le Mans nearly chooses you if it wants you to win, but uh, in a way, uh, we know we need a bit of luck. As always, you need to have the perfect race without technical problems, without driver mistakes, and then you should be running up the front. We've pretty much done everything we can here, except win, so uh, that's what we're going to do. Now we I think, probably run on a, on a wet tires for a little bit of, uh, of practice time, but it's okay. It's been a difficult uh, practice session because we've had wet, dry, wet, dry, wet, dry. Tonight, obviously, it's the first time to run in the night. Let's see when everyone puts their cards on the table where we line up in quality. We learned a lot, especially for the drivers. Quite a good understanding of what the car was doing and now we can prep the car for Q1 and yeah, it will be interesting.